sounds like you need a little more spice in your life. <laughs> Here, take my salt and pepper. Oh, thanks. Hey, El, Marcus is in the house. Yeah. Hey, Yolanda, baby. This saves me a phone call. How about you and me Saturday night? I don't think so. Every time I go out with you, it's a disaster. Name one time. Okay, the TLC concert. As I recall, we got thrown out because our tickets were counterfeit. <laughs> Yeah, but them were some good seats. <laughs> if you paid a little more, you could have got thrown out of even better seats. Too late, Marcus. Ronnie Weems has already asked her out for Saturday night to Debbie Walker's party. That bucket-headed boy. <laughs> Look like he should buy his hat in the hardware store. Well, I just might say yes. I mean, he's sweet, he's honest, and he has his barber's license. I'm tired of riding the bus with you. <laughs> Sweet, honest, and he drives. That would make you 0 for 3. <laughs> At least I'm in the game, all right? Well, I might be in the game, too. I'm going to ask why Nita Herbert to that party. She looked at me twice in the cafeteria. <laughs> she looked at the pepper steak twice, too. That don't mean she want to dance with it. <laughs> anyway, you're on the baby. I'm 16. I'm going to take my driver's test tomorrow. By Saturday, you and I will cruise to Debbie Walker's party. And now, come on, baby, you know you would look good sitting in the car next to me. Well... <laughs> Yolanda, be strong. <laughs> okay, you can take me to the party. Yeah. But you better not mess up, and you better have wheels, and those wheels better not be attached to a bus. <laughs> Imagine any time and place, still the world goes round. In your heart to outer space, the limits are unbound. Life is just a dream in the making. Love makes it easy for the time it's taken. Somebody passed their driver's test? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Somebody failed. I spent three weeks trying to teach this boy the rules of the road, but it just doesn't take it seriously. Apparently, the state of Illinois agrees with me. <laughs> I got the date. I got the date. Juanita said yes. You and me in the car cruising with two dates. Whew! <laughs> Well, I failed the test. You failed? Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that. That would mean that Yolanda is going with Ronnie Weems. Oh, well, I guess I better call him for a ride. <laughs> Me and Ronnie cruising with two dates. Sounds good. <laughs> this ain't fair. I remember when I took my driver's test. Aced it. First time. Some things you just can't teach. Well, I just want to thank everybody for their support. Appreciate that. Oh, come on, Marcus. Don't listen to her. You know, I've got bears in the circus that can drive. <laughs> Why don't you take him out again and practice some more? Because I don't feel like aging 10 years and a half hour. Come on, Mom. I mean, I need to get my license. Can't I just practice a little bit more? I'm about to turn an important corner into manhood here. Yeah, without signaling. Well, how is he going to learn unless somebody takes the time to teach him, huh? How will he ever learn unless someone exhibits the patience necessary to prepare him for the responsibilities of driving? Because after all, a driver's license is more than just a picture and a thumbprint. Well, a driver's license is a milestone. Yes, it's a passport into manhood. It's a ticket to freedom. It's somebody else. Boy, that didn't take long. <laughs> One thing, before we start driving, can you promise me that you won't strangle me like you did last time? Okay. But it wasn't a strangle, it was a 
is a collar grab, you know, with a little shake. No radio. No music? Driving without no music? That's like like dancing without music or, or, or like studying without music. That would explain your grades. <laughs> All right, now I want you to pull out of the driveway slowly. You're in reverse. <laughs> You're in reverse! I told you, you never listen. You think a car is just a couch on wheels. Not true, Ma. I just got to have my music. You ain't getting no music. Ma, it's a man's thing. A man cannot drive without his music. <laughs> well, a man can't drive without his keys either. Can't see me. Where you going, Ma? Let me out the way. 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 driveway, did you? The boy is going to be 21 years old before he gets a driver's license. The only thing he's good at driving is driving me crazy. You know, I'll bet I could turn Marcus into a model driver if I spend an hour or two with him. Oh, really? <laughs> only an hour or two? Well, that would leave you the rest of the afternoon to solve that pesky national health problem. <laughs> Well, I'm sorry, but I'm just trying to help. Oh, oh. You want to help? You want to help? Well, here's the keys. Here you go. There's the door. Use it. I'll be back. <laughs> Parallel. Hey, you know what, Kathy? I gotta tell you, you are a very good teacher. Oh, well. Don't say anything to Mom, but you're better than she is. Oh, well, that'll be our little secret. All right. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, very nice. Good, good. You're doing fine, Marcus. Check your blind spot. All right, approach you to stop sign. You want to ease up? Slow down and come to a complete stop. Good, good, very good. Okay, now we look both ways and proceed. Both ways! Ah! Yes, it was really nice. I enjoyed it. <laughs> and, um, Ma, I'm sorry for giving you a hard time earlier. I'm really gonna start driving by the rules now. <laughs> Whoa! Kathy! I am very impressed with you. He's acting like a different kid. Yeah, yeah, he made a few mistakes, but overall... Great. I guess I better go upstairs and apologize for losing my temper. <laughs> I'm here. I'm alive. I'm not film at 11. They're back. They're back from the test. Let's hope he passed. Tell me you passed. It's a conspiracy. I mean, it's just another way to keep a black man off the road. <laughs> you failed, didn't you? Man, what am I supposed to tell Juanita? We're riding the bus again because Marcus ran another stop sign? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. He didn't run a stop sign. He ran over the examiner's foot. <laughs> but it wasn't my fault. I mean, he shouldn't have been standing there where I was parking. Okay, do we have any aspirin? I've got something much better. A glass of water right in the face does wonders. <laughs> I think I'll just take the ass. <laughs> you should be 
ashamed of yourself. Man, I can take the test again. Oh, face it, Marcus. At the rate you're going, Julie's gonna have her license before you do. <laughs> I can't believe it, man. He's just so stupid. How come you can't pass those? Do I need you to follow me complaining? No, I don't. Yes, I you do. Know. You need me to follow me. <laughs> Poor Marcus. He'll probably mope around all night because he can't drive to that party. Oh, please, girlfriend. Marcus is gonna take the car. How can you say that about your own son? Because teenage boys are guilty until proven innocent. He's gonna take that car. Oh, please. There is no way on God's green earth that Marcus is going to take that car. What do you mean we're gonna take the car? Karen, think about it. I mean, it just wouldn't be gentlemanly to cancel a date on such a short notice. We'll just simply have to steal a car. It's a question of honor. <laughs> Sick in bed. Oh, Mark! 
Mark this, honey? That's impossible. Mark is gonna steal this car. Boy, you just went straight from Mother of the Year, aren't you? Hey. I'm telling you, your son is sick in bed. I should know. He's just borrowed my vaporizer. Are you serious? Come on. Maybe I've been wrong about it. Yes! Yes! Maybe if you'd expect the best from him, you'd be basking in the glory of your son's achievements right now. I guess I should go upstairs and talk to him, huh? I think so. What do you think? Maybe you might come over and help me out of here? <laughs> Watch your back. How did you get oh, in there? Wait a minute. You threw a banana peel in with my recyclables? Hey, I brought some fruit. I didn't know how long I was going to be in there. <laughs> you are amazing. Ain't I just? You never cease to amaze. Man, you are amazing. You knew that mom would try and catch us? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm amazing. Go back there and push the car. Marcus? Marcus, honey? Yes, mama? Marcus, what are you doing in Darren's bed? Oh, oh I get it. You don't want to be by that old drafty window. You okay, baby? Yes, mama? <laughs> You need anything, baby? No, Mama. Well, I'm gonna put an extra blanket on you just in case, because I sure don't want you catching a chill in here. Let me just open this up. There you go. There you go, and Mama is right here, sweetie. Marcus, where'd you get these shoes? Yes, Mama. <laughs> Is this? No, Mama. <laughs> Marcus, you want me to cancel your tuba lesson? Uh, 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 yes, Mama. <laughs> Did Marcus put you up to this? Yes, Mama. <laughs> You feel like you've evolved in the world. Just wait till you get your license. You see what I mean? Maybe we should wait till you get your license. <laughs> Marcus on the wheels and still ladies, step right in. <laughs> Do I got it going on or what? <laughs> Alright. It's about time, Marcus. In another two minutes, Juanita and I have been walking and dissing you like dogs. Oh, we had a little trouble with the car. Yeah, our mechanic was fine-tuning the mix on a carburetor. See, it was running a little rich. Ain't that right, Darren? Oh, yeah, rich. Our carburetor is rich. Here we go. I'd like to get to the party before my sister finds out her shoes are missing. All right, my bitch. Let's boogie down. Hey, wait a minute. I knew I forgot something. My jingle. Got to have my jingle. <laughs> learned his lesson. Kathy, in case you forgot, he took the car without my permission and he drove without a license. Now that is not only against the law, it's dangerous. Look, not like I'm on his side or anything, but he's never been more polite. I've never seen his room cleaner. And yesterday, I caught him reading a book. <laughs> Nick, give me a break, okay? And he stopped watching TV. It's been two weeks since I've heard, Hey, show sure stuff, change the channel. I kind of miss him. Now, Mom, no one likes to see Marcus punished more than I do. 
Hey, don't you think he suffered enough? I mean, you got your caught in the act. Hey, don't start with me, because you were in the car with him. Now, do you want to talk about that? I say lock him up until he's 30. <laughs> you know you're all a bunch of wimps, don't you? All of them. Oh, go get him. Go get him. Marcus! The warden wants to see you. I love you, Mommy. Okay, Marcus, here's the deal. I'm gonna take you out and let you drive just to see if you've learned anything. Now, don't start grinning. Because if you make one mistake, you will be right back upstairs in that room. But if you do all right, I'll think about letting you take the test again. You were such a good and just mother. <laughs> Yeah, I know. 